Okay, so uh, parts laid out here for issue 24. Uh, build the Fast and Furious Dodge Charger. Yeah, uh, the battery. It's going to be building up the battery. Some quite nice detailing on the battery. Sticker on there. Um, yeah, it's quite small parts as well. Left them in the bag so I don't kind of lose them at this point. So I'm not too sure where they're going to go. But um, yeah, uh, you're going to be constructing the battery, assembling the battery, and then it's going to be going on to one of these side parts that we've built up over the last couple of issues. So uh, yeah, so we'll get straight into it. This will be the build for issue 24. Okay, so first things first, bring over the battery or the main part of the battery. So this part we've looked at before, and then the top part, uh, just trying to work out which way around it goes. It can only really go one way, to be fair, it won't fit the other way. So it's just gonna look like the top of the battery. Yeah, it's gonna be looking like that. But yeah, it can only really go one way. And then two AP screws to hold that on that top part. Okay, that's what looks like. Top part on. And the bottom part goes on. Just trying to work out which way around that goes. I guess it goes to the rear. Once again, because of the way they're angled, can you get one the wrong way around? Probably. No. no. Okay. And then AP screws again. Okay. That's what it looks like. Pretty good. Okay, so now we've got these kind of long mounting screws. In plastic, like that. So that's the wing nut on the top. Yeah. And now we're going to get the battery over, and the clamp is going to have to kind of go in. I guess there's a right way and a wrong way for this clamp to go. Yes, I think. No, no, it seems, it seems to be a right way and a wrong way. Yeah, definitely a right way and a wrong way. One way won't actually go over these terminals, or there we go. What terminals are they? They're just filling holes. So you just push that down, like it. Put one of these there you go. It kind of fits in like that. I don't it's gonna go on, you don't need any super glue or anything like that, I don't think. Turn it around and it just goes in into nothing. This is that sit in. Okay, so that's kind of what that looks like. It's got those wing nuts on the top. It's quite nice. Nice bit of small details. The left panel, so the one with the L on it, obviously. And then you've got screw holes on here. They're going to attach. Trying to find out where. Okay, just into there on the. It kind of sits like that. Yeah. 
Yeah. And with AP screws again. So it's obviously, yeah, I'm going to hide that wing up one. Yeah. It'd be quite difficult, quite easy to cross thread these. So make sure it is well and truly flat against the body. All good. Okay, so these terminals you've got to identify. One's a positive and one's a negative terminal. So it's identifying, I guess, which one's which. I think that one's the positive one. Yeah, it's got the straight all the way through it. And the negative one is angled. Yeah. So the negative one is angled and this one is straight. Yeah. And the positive one goes with the longest um, hose, wire, whatever you want to call it. So the positive one, there we go, has the longest wire on it the negative one has the shortest as I say the kind of way I've identified them is the angled and the straight so positive and the negative or wires <coughs> now the negative one goes on this as it says this this so the closest to the front and then the free end of that, so that goes onto the battery, obviously. And then the free end is a little pin on the actual bodywork that this goes into. The free end of this goes into. And then the positive. And this doesn't go anywhere, so this just gets attached, and then I'm sure this will get attached in a up and coming issue. But that just dangles free. So there we go. That's the battery attached, and the positive negative terminals attached. Battery onto the bodywork. Okay, so that was issue 24. Yep, just that uh, battery going into the bodywork. Issue 25. Coming up, assembling the firewall. Okay, yep, yeah, so it's just, I don't think we're fitting it onto the car. No, it's just assembling that, but it'll be assembling the firewall. That'll be issue 25, and that's coming up soon.